Hey, it's Rob, the Ignorant Entrepreneur. Now, you may notice that my voice is sounding a little bit different, a little more HD. That's because I bought a new mic. I'm very excited about it. And with that, let's start this video off right and talk about black business for the month of February. Who better to start with than Rihanna Savage X Fenty Company reaches a $1 billion valuation in lingerie equity. Now, many of you may not know this, but Rihanna is my celebrity crush, and it's great to see that the fashion, culture, and private equity have collided with Rihanna's successful Savage X Fenty, hitting another major milestone by raising its $150 million Series B funding round at a $1 billion valuation. Private equity firm L. Catterton, in which LVMH has a stake in, helped the brand secure this bag for its upcoming retail expansion and to funnel it into a line of athletic wear. Rihanna's umbrella, Ella, Ella, a product lines under her Fenty brand have been extremely successful with her lingerie brand sitting squarely at the center of business and culture in the 13.1 billion U.S. women's underwear sector, leaving Savage X Fenty partner LVMH to completely lean in on her diverse business model. And for the breakdown you need to know, the lingerie brand posted revenue growth of more than 200% last year and increased its active VIP member base by more than 150%, according to a statement from the company. Culture Banks reported that Savage X Fenty is in the position to be the global lingerie market leader by 2025, the same year that women's activewear is expected to reach a $216.9 billion value. Rihanna's brand has proven that diversity and inclusion in sizing, access, and marketing can lead to an even greater goal, equity and feeling sexy. Bow. LVMH and Rihanna added in a statement to WWD, basically reaffirming their ambition to concentrate on growth and long-term development of the Fenty ecosystem, focusing on cosmetics, skincare, and lingerie. So what's next? Less than two years after Rihanna's high-end Fenty fashion brand launched with LVMH, it is now being put on hold to focus on expanding the lingerie brand. The coronavirus crisis made it difficult to create eight ready-to-wear collections a year while operating remotely. The global fashion industry experienced a 93% drop in profit from 2020. Rihanna made history as the first woman to create an original brand at LVMH and the first woman of color at the top of an LVMH Mason. The e-commerce site for Fenty Fashion will go dark by the end of February or early March. What do you guys I think we're not getting as much music, but the fashion is clearly thriving for Rihanna. Let me know in the comments section below. Like, comment, subscribe. This has been the Ignorant Entrepreneur. I'm out.